Dan Garcia, and I'm going to show you how to play tremolo, flamenco tremolo. Okay, this is a very attractive technique. It's one of those techniques that people ask you always. How do you do that? How do you do that? It sounds like two or three guitars playing at the same time. And yes, it's one of those techniques that actually sounds harder than it actually is, but it's definitely not easy. Okay, you need to practice very carefully and with a lot of patience. But this is how it works. Basically, for every bass note I play, I'm going to play the string that's playing the melody. In this case, I was playing on the first string. I'm going to play four notes for every bass note. Okay, and the way I'm going to play these four notes is with my index first, then A, and then M, and then I again. Okay, so that makes it a quintuplet. This is the flamenco tremolo. In classical guitar, you play tremolo by playing 16th notes, which is one, two, three, four notes per beat. So the flamenco guitar adds one more note to the mix, so we, we have a quintuplet. So we play thumb, always first, then index, A, M, I. Thumb, I, M, The purpose of this technique is really to sustain a melody, to keep a melody on the top afloat. The problem with a guitar is that the decay of a note is very quick. So sometimes if we want to sustain a melody, it's really not possible. We play the note and it rapidly fades away. You know, violinists and other instrumentalists have ways of keeping a note afloat with the bow and such. We really don't. The only way we can do it is repeating it. And if we repeat it many, many times very, very fast, it gives us, that, gives us that sound or that illusion that the note is being held or almost bowed. Okay, so let's give it a, uh, let's give it a try. Okay, so thumb. how tremolo works. It's a technique that you have to practice very, very slow. And also, one of the common mistakes with tremolo when you practice tremolo is that you try to go too fast, too quick, and what happens is you lose the attack okay, on the upper string. Okay? So make sure you play it with plenty of volume when you're going slow. speed it up with that same kind of volume. If you feel like you really lose some volume when you speed up, bring it down a notch, okay, and keep working on it every day. Mm -hmm. 